it used to be that bonds were called fixed income. Um, well, when the yield is zero, that's fixed non-income. It, it seems to me that if you view it as a fixed income asset, that reshapes the way you think about it. Uh, if the income is zero or negative, why would you want that? If it's negative in real terms, below the rate of inflation, why would you want that? Uh, today, contrary to a year ago, uh, the 10, 10 and 20 year tips have reasonably nice yields. 1.7% uh, today for uh, the 10 year, 1.8 for the 20 year. Um, backed by full faith and credit of the US Treasury, that's not a bad real return, um, where a year ago it was negative for 10 years and slightly positive for 20. So uh, to me, um, uh, if you think about bonds as fixed income, they're one, your risk off asset, place to put money that when you want to go risk off, uh, and two, a source of fixed income. And it better be positive in real terms, even as a risk off asset, you want positive in real